In the previous video, we witnessed the incredible skills of the false widow spider in action, a patient, calculating predator, that managed, with flawless strategy, to seize another spider's meal, with absolute precision. This spider seems to know no limits, capturing prey much larger than itself, such as the blue bottle fly, Califera vamatoria, known for its larger size compared to the common housefly. Yet even it succumbs to the sticky silk and the venom of the false widow. This is the Stetoda peculiana, a species that stands out for its remarkable instinctive intelligence. It can analyze its surroundings, assess threats, and make complex decisions, showing a level of cunning rarely seen in invertebrates. Its territorial behavior and ability to exploit the weaknesses of other spiders reveal a mind built for survival. After capturing and wrapping the blue bottle fly, the spider will search for the softest part of its body to begin feeding. Nothing is left to chance, she carefully wraps the fly, creating a silk barrier that not only hides her meal from potential predators, but also, thanks to its composition rich in hydroscopic proteins, helps to preserve the prey longer, keeping it fresh and protected. This new prey is no ordinary insect it's an earwig, equipped with powerful rear pincers. A versatile predator, omnivorous, capable of crushing a spider the size of the Pecaliana with ease. But this spider, sensing it is not facing a typical prey, responds with remarkable intelligence. Her first move is not to attack, but to disable the pincers, quickly wrapping them in silk neutralizing the greatest threat before moving in. It seems no arthropod can resist her. Pay close attention to how she has chained the earwig against the wall, first wrapping its legs and pincers with strong silk. Once fully immobilized, she carries it to a safe place, next to her previous prey, the blue bottle fly, wrapping all the food into a single package compact, discreet, and perfectly secured. There's a fascinating detail few people know about these spiders, some species in the Stetoda genus are capable of recycling their own silk, carefully dismantling old threads to reabsorb their proteins and reuse them in new constructions. An astonishing example of biological efficiency, allowing them to conserve energy and adapt better to resource scarce environments. While the Stetoda calmly enjoys her feast, she is unknowingly being watched by another spider. From the shadows, it studies every move, every thread, every vibration. It knows there are two captured prey, and possibly a third. Because if it chooses to act, the Stetona herself might end up on the menu. The intruder is immediately detected by the alarm system formed by the false widow's silk threads. Every vibration, every step, gives her away. And this is no ordinary visitor it has a more robust body, greater strength, impressive speed, and larger chelicerae, capable of piercing through the exoskeleton of other spiders. The false widow knows she is facing a real threat, and must proceed with extreme caution. The Stetoda doesn't attack, but sends strong vibrations to try and scare off the intruder. She manages to make the intruder back off, but the danger isn't over yet. If it decides to leap onto her, it could all end in a heartbeat. Pay close attention to this spectacular moment, it seems the Stetoda has the other spider cornered, but in an unexpected twist, she pulls back toward her food. It's remarkable how, even among territorial predators, sometimes intelligence prevails over conflict. 
The spider has sensed that the intruder no longer seeks to steal her meal or engage in a fight. Instead of attacking, the Stetoda unleashes a sequence of threats and rhythmic vibrations, carried through her web as a clear, silent message, this territory is already claimed. In the world of spiders, where every strand speaks intent, mastering vibrational language can be the key to avoiding risk and ensuring survival. The false widow reveals her fangs, sharp and ready to strike. Had she wanted to, she could have bitten the intruder without hesitation. But she doesn't. In a moment of absolute control, she grants one last chance to flee. A cold, calculated decision full of power. The Stetoda already had enough food, and perhaps that's why she chose not to take the conflict any further. In the mysterious world of these spiders, where every thread is a decision and every move a strategy, Actions don't always follow instinct, but a logic we're only beginning to understand. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe to keep watching more content like this.